Hello, I'm George Fischer Harvitsiotis. I was born and raised in Athens and I'm now based in Düsseldorf. After my musical and medical studies, I became an ophthalmologist and a pharmacy surgeon, later on, a psychoanalyst and group analyst. As such, I deliver coaching to executives and executive groups, as well as executive education in corporates and lectures on psychology of leadership in universities. What does coaching mean to you? In my eyes, coaching is a dialogue in a safe space where an individual or a group explore and detect their own questions in order to find their own answers in specific situations. Is there something in particular which you would suggest to your students as a coach? <laughs> I would say try to find out who you are, what you want. Try to cope with the new challenges and above all, don't forget to enjoy. Which is the predominant feeling you can recall as a student? Happiness, at least from today's perspective. But there was also a certain amount of uncertainty and anxiety at the very beginning. But yes, the predominant feeling is happiness. You graduated from various studies. Which was your compass? Curiosity and instinct of play. Two properties which are leading me up to now. Which challenges should young people accept at the beginning of their career and which defer? Well, I would advise embrace all important challenges and defer all unimportant. Funny thing is that you only retrospectively know which is which. So, joking aside, don't aim at perfection, but at good enough. Which properties will be characteristic of tomorrow's leaders? I don't know, and I cannot know. But I hope a commitment to personal mastery, a high amount of tolerance of ambiguity, and a marked ability and readiness for radical cooperation in real and virtual networks. If you could wish for a skill or property, in ultimate perfection, what would this be and why? Equanimity, in order to accept imperfection and more often and more courageously ask such questions as why.